Yeah, thanks for that, Agam. And as you rightly said, compared to previous year, the EV sales have grown tremendously this year, registering a total sales of roughly 9,44,000 vehicles. Now, why this matters is that the top four payers who are in this space, uh, namely Ola Electric, TVS, Bajaj, as well as Aether, have all performed really well. Starting with Ola Electric, they're the first company to show uh, sales above 3 lakh units sold in uh, one financial year and has shown a growth of roughly 100% compared to previous year. Uh, TBS Motor is the number two player and this has been a very, very positive surprise, growing to 1,80,000 vehicles and above 120% compared to previous year. The IQ has done phenomenally well for the company over the past year and they've also had a second launch with the TBS Smart X priced at a 2.5 lakh price range, which is premium to compare to its other peers. Thirdly, Aether Energy is the third, uh, which has grown at 42%, which is lower compared to the other peers, but has maintained the 1 lakh sales mark above in the financial year. And finally, Bajaj Auto. This has been one of the most present surprises, growing at 200% compared to previous year. The Chetak has finally been uh, used properly. It has national distribution as well uh, all over India, which has led to the sales growth of above 1 lakh, and it is knocking on the market share of someone like Aether, growing from just 4% market share in the previous year all the way up to 11%. Going forward, we expect a lot more launches from TVS as well as Bajaj in the listed space and also some news around Aether as well as Ola going forward in this. Uh, that's all we have right now on, on, on this particular space and uh, uh, back to you, Agam. Okay, thank you so much for getting, that, getting us that update, Puneet. Uh, some interesting trends out there. Uh, Asa, pertaining to the stock market, of course, uh, in the listed space, we can talk about TVS Motor Company and Bajaj Auto and the, the kind of waves and the kind of plans that they are, have in store as far as the EV space goes. Uh, your take on this specific subject? So, yes, uh, in fact, we are also uh, positive on this counter, especially looking after the EV. I mean, uh, penetration which is going on in the country also, that is what we are seeing around also. So, yes, uh, TVS motor is looking good to us because there are two, three more reasons. First of all, uh, we can see uh, the expansion in their margin because now they are looking more into the Latin America and the European markets. So, that is also an, uh, on the base of the competitive technology. They have an edge in their uh, technology as well as innovation. I think TVS is well poised to garner the future opportunities present in the sector. So uh, uh, out of all these uh, counters, we are uh, very much positive on the TVS motor. And in fact, if I to talk uh, between these two, TVS as, as well as Bajaj Auto, then also we are positive on TVS motor. Price target can be set at 23.50. Okay, there you have it. That's uh, as far as TVS Motor Company goes. Let's move.